Flu shots are easier than ever to get in Canada, and while clinics seem busy, they could be busier. Two-thirds of Canadians still don't get immunized, often because they feel they're healthy enough. I don't think that if I get it, it's going to guarantee me not to have the flu. And I don't know, I just, I don't think that it's that important. I am a doctor, so it's generally thought to be the right thing to do for us. So uh, it was given to me by the nurse at uh, UHN. I haven't taken these for years and I haven't gotten the flu. So why now? It's a fair question. The Public Health Agency of Canada acknowledges vaccines aren't always effective, especially in seniors. There's also evidence that in rare cases, some vaccines may actually make us more susceptible to the flu. But new research suggests getting vaccinated regularly now can protect us from other diseases later in life. Every time we get immunized, our bodies make antibodies to that flu vaccine. And what happens is those antibodies last for decades. And so every time I'm vaccinated for influenza, I'm building up a little bank of these antibodies. These scientists are digging deeper into why seniors are more prone to other illnesses after getting the flu. And the answer may lie in a creature that models our immune system. Lab tests show when elderly mice received flu vaccines early in life, they were healthier and less likely to get other chronic illnesses as seniors. But old mice that were never immunized not only got other diseases sooner, when they got the flu, it accelerated the progress of those diseases, even after the flu went away. What happens when we're older and we develop a pneumonia or an influenza is we have a lot of inflammation. And that inflammation, for reasons we don't really understand, doesn't go away. And so what it does is it contributes to other inflammatory diseases, things like dementia, cardiovascular disease, and things like type 2 di diabetes. These researchers are now using what they've learned about flu shots to try to block inflammations in older mice. They're also zeroing in on a way to boost protective microbes in our nose and lungs. While their work offers hope to chronically ill seniors, for now, a flu shot might still offer the best protection. Vicodopia, CBC News, Toronto.